Get out. Get that drink out. These are unlicensed premises. You're in a terrible humour today, Mr Webber. <laughs> and on your birthday, too. With a good lady getting her strength up to give you a party. <laughs> I told you to get those bottles out. Mr Webber, sit down a minute. Let me just make this clear. You don't bother me. To me, you're nothing but a dirty joke. But I have a responsibility towards the people in this house. They've been down here too long. They've lost their sense of smell. I haven't. And nobody's going to take advantage of them while I'm here. Anyway, this house isn't your cup of tea. There's nothing for you here. From any angle. Any angle. So why don't you just go without any more fuss? Mr Webber, sit down. It's no good starting any kind of trouble. Sit down. Why should I? If you want to know the truth, Webber, you're beginning to get on my tits. Really? Well, that's... Sit down! No! McCann? Nat? Ask him to sit down. Yes, Nat. Do you mind sitting down? Yes, I do mind. It'd be better if you did. Why don't you sit down? Not me, you. No, thanks. Nat, he won't sit down. Well, ask him. I've asked him. Ask him again. Sit down. Why? You'd be more comfortable. So would you. All right. If you will, I will. You first. Well? Right. Now you've both had a rest. You can get out. That's a dirty trick. I'll kick the shite out of him. No, no, no. I have stood up. Sit down again. Once I'm up, I'm up. Same here. You made Mr Golbo stand up. It'll do him good. Get in that seat. McCann. Get down in that seat. Webber, sit down. You'd better be careful. Webber, what were you doing yesterday? Yesterday? And the day before. What did you do the day before that? What do you mean? Why are you wasting everyone's time, Webber? Why are you getting in everyone's way? Me? What are you... I'm telling you, Webber, you're all a washout. Why are you getting on everyone's... Why are you driving that old lady off her cock? He likes to do it. Why do you behave so badly, Webber? Why do you force that old man out to play chess? Me? Why do you treat that young lady like a leper? She's not the leper, Webber. What the... Why do you wear last week, Webber? Where do you keep your suits? Why did you leave the organisation? What would your old mum say, Webber? Why did you betray us? You hurt me, Webber. You're playing a dirty game. You're on the wrong horse. When did you come to this place? Last year. Where did he come from? Somewhere else. Why did he come here? My feet are... Why did you stay? I had a headache. Did you take anything for it? Yes. What? Fruit salts. He knows or Andrews? And, uh, and did you stir properly? Did they fizz? Now, now, wait. You... Did they fizz? Did they fizz or didn't they fizz? He doesn't know. He don't know. When did you last have a bath? I have one every... Don't lie. You betrayed the organisation. I know him. You don't? What can you see without any glasses? Anything. Take off his glasses. Webber, you're a fake. When did you last wash up a cup? The Christmas before last. Where? Lion's Corner House. Which one? Marble Arch. Where was your wife? In... Answer. What wife? What have you done with your wife? He killed his wife. When did you kill your wife? What wife? How did he kill her? How did he kill her? You throttled her. With arsenic. That's your man. Where's your old mum? In the sanatorium. Why did he never get married? He was waiting at the porch. You skedaddled from the wedding. You left her in the lurch. You left her in the pudding club. She was waiting at the church. Weber, why did you change your name? I forgot the other one. What's your name now? Joe Soap. You stink of sin. Oh, I can smell it. Do you recognise an external force? What? Do you recognise an external force? That's the question. Do you recognise an external force responsible for you, suffering for you? It's late. Late, late enough. When did he last pray? He's sweating. When did he last pray? He's sweating. Is the number possible or necessary? 
Neither. No, wrong. Is a number possible or necessary? Both. Wrong. It's necessary but not possible. Both. Wrong. Why do you think the number is necessarily possible? It must be. Wrong. It's only necessarily necessary. It's possible but because necessary, but by no means necessary through possibility. <laughs> the possibility can only be assumed after the proof of necessity. Right. Right. Of course right. We're right and you're wrong, Weber. All along the line. All along the line. Where is your lechery leading you now? You'll pay for this. You'll stuff yourself with dry toast. You contaminate womankind. Why don't you pay the rent? Mother defiler. Why do you pick your nose? I demand justice. What's your trade? What about Ireland? What's your trade? I play the piano. How many fingers do you use? No hands. <laughs> no society would touch you. Not even a building society. You're a traitor to the cloth. What do you use for pyjamas? Nothing. You verminate the sheet of your birth. Why did the chicken cross the road? He, he wanted to... He, he wanted, wanted to... He, he doesn't know! Why did the chicken cross the road? He wanted... He, he wanted. Why did the chicken cross the road? He wanted... He doesn't know. He doesn't know which came first. Which came first? Which came first? Which came first? Which, which came, came first? first? Which came first? Which came first? Wake him up. Stick a needle in his eye. You're a plague, Weber. You're an overthrow. You're what's left. But we've got the answer to you. We can sterilise you. What about Your bite is dead and your pong is left. You betrayed our land. You betray our breed. Who are you, Weber? What makes you think you exist? You're dead. You're dead. You can't live. You can't think. You can't love. You're dead. You're a plague gone bad. There's no juice in you. You're nothing but an... Odor. Steady McCann. Right, Judas. Steady McCann. Come on. <laughs> He's sweating. <laughs> Easy McCann. That bastard sweat pig is sweating. <laughs>